Shaka Smart is leaving Richmond. CBS 6 News has learned that ECU men's basketball coach has accepted a reported multi-million dollar offer to coach the Texas Longhorns. Good evening, I'm Bill Fitzgerald. And we've got team coverage tonight. Our Chelsea Rarick is standing by on the campus of ECU where Smart just met with his team. But first, I'm joined by sports director Lane Casadante. We knew a day like today would come, but still it stings a little bit. It's like dating a really pretty girl. Everybody <laughs> is, you know, very interested in her. Shaka Smart has built VCU into the national presence that it is now. It was a good program before he's made it a better program. We go through this every year. You go back to Marquette, NC State, Illinois, UCLA. He's turned them all down. This one we felt was different from the very beginning. Now we know why he is getting a reported five year deal worth anywhere in the neighborhood from 14 to 18 million dollars a year, at least doubling his salary at v from VCU. And does he have a better chance at winning a national championship there than he would here? Was it just too much of a, of a stretch to it's do It's all it about resources for not only the athletic department as a whole, but for the basketball team in specific. And nobody has more resources than the University of Texas. They have their own TV network kind of hard to turn resources like that down. We have a statement tonight that has been released by VCU Athletic Director Ed McLaughlin. It was just released within the last few minutes and it reads, quote, out of respect for Coach Smart and the University of Texas, we decline comment at this point. I have spoken with Coach Smart and we will have a statement tomorrow. Again, that's Ed McLaughlin, the VCU Director of Athletics. Chelsea Rarick is down at the Siegel Center where Coach Smart just left a meeting, or his players left a meeting that they held well, we just about 10:15 tonight. When Shaka Smart arrived here at the Seagull Center, he actually came through right this door here, right here. Now, earlier today, there was a lot of support for Shaka Smart. There was a, a, a rally right outside the Seagull Center here, where a lot of people said that they were going to support Coach Smart no matter what decision he had. However, some students said they really wanted to stay here just because he has really done so much for this entire community. Now, we do not know if Coach Smart has left the Seagull Center yet. The, the car that he appeared to arrive in is still here, and we've been waiting by this door and have not seen him. But once again, he did arrive here around 10 o'clock tonight to meet with the players. He did not say anything, just walked straight into that side door. So obviously going to be a lot of mixed emotions tonight for students and members of the community. And we should once again expect a statement from VCU regarding Coach Smart leaving. But for now, I'm reporting live at VCU tonight. Chelsea. CBS 6 News. Lane, I'll send it on back to you. All right, thanks, Chelsea, very much. We we're expecting the University of Texas to make the formal announcement. That should come sometime tomorrow afternoon. Three million a year or so is tough to turn About down. About three, 3.2 million, uh, 14 to 18 million over the life of the five year mm -hmm. deal, yes. All right, thanks. we'll have more coming up in sports. Thank you, Lane, for